What's up everyone? How are we doing today? My name is Cristiano Lorenzo and welcome to my channel if you've never been here before. So first of all, please do not forget to subscribe, like this video and comment because the more likes, comments and subscribers I have, the YouTube start to show to more people and more people start to come right here and I'm gonna be so happy with this because I really need this, you know? Because I'm working too hard for this channel and I really hope this channel grows and grows more and more, okay? So, yes, I will give you five seconds to subscribe to this channel while I eat this cookie dough right here. Okay, so subscribe. I'm just gonna eat this while you're subscribing, okay? This is good. Mm -hmm. It was good. Okay, so in today's video, I'll do the unboxing and also talk a little bit of the Air Max Trix 96. Yeah, that's a big name, huh? <laughs> like the name suggests, this one was released in 96 when I was just a little baby, so I really don't remember that. But Nike just decided to release it again, you know, to re release. I don't know. <laughs> and yes, I just got it right here with me, so let's do the unboxing, huh? Okay, I got right here a big box. Oh, oh. I know that it's a big box for only one pair of shoes, but let me explain it to you. It's because I also got those two pairs of shoes right here that I'm gonna do a review and the unboxing as well. But first of all, let's do the unboxing of the Air Max. Okay, look at this box, nice. Huh, look. I never saw a Nike box like this, you know, normally the, the Nike shoes that I got is more like, like this, you know, like orange and red like this, but okay, cool, looks nice. And also there's like a message here, engineer and build to the exact specifications of the championship, athletes from around the world. Ooh, fancy, huh? Okay, so let's open. Looks beautiful, guys. It's beautiful. Look at this. Ah, look how beautiful is this. And also the good things about like Nike's Air Max is because there's so many different types of models that you really, if you don't like this shape right here, if you look it up, you will find a, a shape or a different type of model that you really like. And that's nice, but I like this one right here. It's like a classic shape. Right? As you can see right here is the color red with white and some black parts right here too. But I look at the website, um, actually I bought this one right here from the website Essence. I guess that's how you pronounce it, S and Sense. And over there they have really nice prices for shoes and everything. So I really got from there. And uh, yeah, they have in the color um, blue and also red, but I decided to get the red one right here because it's beautiful. When you check the laces right here, you can see that it's like a rope lace. I don't know if you can really see this, but it's like rope lace right here. The tongue right here is a good size. It's not like too big or too small. It's like a medium one, like a perfect size for it. And here you can see the air, you know, like the Air Max logo right here. Beautiful, beautiful, I like it. And inside you can see Trix. There's like Trix inside. The midsole right here is all white. There's like this red details right here. But um, I know that for some people can be a problem because you know, it gets dirty too fast. Like, you know, the first time that you go out to the streets, it gets dirty. But by, the, by touching right here, it looks like pretty simple to clean, you know, pretty easier to clean. Just a, like a little bit of water can clean like easier. So that's a good sign. And also if you check right here in the also, you can see like the Nike logo, some red, some different shapes right here, which is beautiful. I don't know what I have with outsoles, but I really like when the outsole is like different, you know, when it's not like all black or something. I know that it's just the outsole. I just, but I just feel like that I want to show everyone the outsole, you know, like I want to put my feet up and show like look how beautiful it is you know <laughs> it's a shame that we cannot do this I mean we can if you want but like it's weird <laughs> there's like the Nike logo right here in the front right here in the two sides of it and also in the back but in the color blue right here mm -hmm. it's so hot guys we are in the, in the summer here in Massachusetts and it's like ooh, Jesus Christ, I'm like dying right here. You know, I have to put some lights and now I'm like melting. Oh, Jesus, but okay, keep going. <laughs> I was reading a little bit about those shoes right here, like back in the past when they are first released. And yeah, um, it was a, a runner shoes, 
which is really interesting. And the shape looks like pretty classic. What I love most about it is because that, yeah, have the have this like, I don't know, retro vibe, you know, the, this classic shape right here. I just love it, you know, I think it's a really good idea of Nike to bring this back. This has a big sentimental value on those shoes because um, for those people who were kids or teenagers at that time, and now they have a chance, you know, to to use it again, or those people who never had a chance to see it, you know, like those sneaker fans who saw those shoes in the internet, like like old shoes and stuff, and now they can have the chance to use it today, you know? So that's a really cool thing. Cause I remember when I was younger back in Brazil, and there's like some shoes um, or some products that I didn't have the chance to have, because I mean, my parents were paying mine and my sister's uh, school and like bills and everything, they have to work so hard. And some shoes and some products were not that, you know, were not that cheap, or sometimes, most of the time were really expensive. So a lot of products when I was a kid, I was not able to have it. And when they, when I see they, they're they bringing back something, I got like, oh my God, I really want this because I didn't have the chance to have back when I was a kid, you know? <laughs> this is a really good idea. It also came with this right here. Like, um, I don't know what it is. Anatomical arch support system. Okay, it's anatomical art support. Okay, cool. It comes with this too. Good, good, good. And um, just remember you guys that I'm not like a professional. I'm not a person who really works with shoes and knows everything about the history of the shoes and blah, blah, blah. But, um, you know, I'm, I'm just a person, I'm just a guy who likes shoes, like different types of shoes, and I like to show them. I'm looking for some type of product, and especially shoes. I go to YouTube, I go to websites to see the review, to, to see how they look on feet, just to, you know, just to have an idea how it is. It's a really cool experience because I'm learning a little bit more of something that I like, you know? So I hope you guys also like this, you know, like my my view on those shoes. I know that it's not like a total professional, and you know, like, oh my God, this is made by this uh, material right here and that, but you know, I'm trying and I guess like video by video, by video, I'm gonna get better and a little bit more like professional on this. So yes, for me, this is really good. You know, a lot of people from different places are messaging me and say like, hey, I saw your video, it's really cool. And I'm like, oh my God, thank you so much. I really appreciate that. <laughs> if you're interested in these shoes right here, or you know someone who's like, mm, maybe this person will like these shoes right here, just show my video, you know, maybe it helps the person to provide the shoes or for yourself, you know what I mean? I don't know. So about the sizing, normally when I got like Nike shoes, they are not like, um, you know, to, you don't have to go up or down on, shoe, on the size, you just have to get your own size that is gonna fit well. So I think that this one is gonna be the same. If you know that this is like maybe a little bit bigger on your feet, if you got like your size or you have to go a size up to fit on your feet, just let me know in the comments, you know, but I think that the size is like pretty much the same that as your feet. Okay, so that was the video guys. I hope you guys like it. Thank you so much for staying with me right here. The last video that I record, uh, the Crocs one, um, I just have like 52 subscribers for now and I just got um, a thousand views, you know what I mean? I know that doesn't look like a lot of views, but for me it's a big deal since I have 52 subscribers and I'm not doing, I don't have any way to, you know, put this out there for a lot of people to see. So since I just put this on YouTube and a lot of people are coming, Thank you so much for watching the videos, you know, and thank you everyone who's like subscribing here and like giving me like notes, commenting what they think of the video, you know, like sharing experience with the same shoes that I'm showing right here. I hope um, you guys subscribe, you know, to see the next videos that I'm gonna be recording here and showing to you. Follow me on social media too, you know, like Instagram, I'm gonna put right here somewhere, you know? <laughs> and uh, subscribe to my channel, comment, like, and that's it. See you next time, bye.